Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Grand Auto 5 Firefighter Mod video. Today we're going to be running as the Polito Bay Fire Department. We're going to be using some new skins by Skinworks on Medic 4523 Fire Trucks. So, uh, let's go ahead and take a quick look at all of the trucks and I'll show you guys which one we are going to be using today. Well, it kind of depends on what type of calls we get, but I kind of am leaning towards one truck in particular. Let me know what you guys uh, think about all the trucks and which one is your favorite in this pack so first off we have the engine this is going to be engine one Polito Bay fire and rescue take a look at that they got like the like Bigfoot in the middle that's pretty cool is Bigfoot out here guys maybe we'll find Bigfoot today that would be pretty cool so we have the Freightliner engine we have used this thing in the past with a variety of skins I'm really liking this lime green color this is really looking cool beautiful and then next up we have this is going to be tack rescue one so this is like a mini rescue of the winch on the front we may be able to do some winch out jobs with this crew cab so we can hold a lot of people with all of our compartments back here for rescue equipment just to show you guys a couple of things that we have uh, let's see got my saw we are going to be using fire callouts today as well. So we got the saw. If we got to cut anybody out of anything. Uh, what else do I have that I can show you? I'm trying to remember the controls. Oh, there we go. Yep. Do some truck work as well. A bunch of different things we could do. Um, over here, we have a mini pumper. Um, I think we could kind of use this one as a press truck. Um, they call it a mini engine. At least that's what the download file calls it. But um basically yeah that's exactly what it says it's a engine on a ford chassis which is pretty cool and like i said i think we may use this one as a brush truck so this is truck one and last but not least we have our chief chief one so let me know what you guys think about all of these trucks and for me today i think we're gonna start off with the uh truck one here the mini pumper i feel like this will be pretty cool so let's see if we get any brush calls guys and uh, yeah, let's go ahead and jump into this episode. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this. And let's go ahead and get started. All units, we have a wildfire in the Chile Mountain State Wilderness. Alright, we're getting a call, a report of a brush fire off of Great Ocean Highway. We are going to hop into the mini engine here looks like it's about a mile and a half away we are going to request addition units as well so we're going to roll out with the engine may need the chief as well we'll see what happens oh we got something going on up there that's a pretty heavy smoke condition you can see it from a mile away here all right so the engine may have some trouble getting up there the terrain is a little rough so that's where this truck comes in handy make our way up this trail and let's put out this fire so this call that we are responding to this is part of fire call outs you guys can download it on lspdfr for free i am on a beta version though um, the beta version you could get on patreon on panels is patreon page and it just has a couple of extra features which are work in progress it's a little buggy sometimes but um eventually like once panos works everything out it will be free and public on LSVDFR, but for now, some of the features you're going to see are just in the beta version, which is what we are on, and the main feature you guys are going to see is going to be the hose and the nozzle, which is pretty exciting and probably my favorite feature for fire callouts. Alright, where are we going? I feel like I could just take a shortcut right here, but I don't know, the terrain is pretty bad, so... Let me stick to this road. Yeah, 
Yeah, the engine is going to have a little bit of trouble getting up here. Now, we do not have an unlimited amount of water on this thing, obviously, so I'm pretty sure we're still going to need the engine to put out this fire, depending on how big it is. Alright, looks like we are on scene. I'm going to try to see which way the fire is pushing. Judging by the smoke, it looks like it's pushing this way. I don't really want to be ahead of it, but I'm just trying to do a quick 360 here. May have to stretch a line. Maybe from up here would be a good spot. I can kind of go down and attack it. All right, I think that's going to be our game plan. So let's go ahead and get ready to go. All right, we're gonna also go ahead and turn this pump on. And let's start stretching the line. All right, so we have the hose stretched. And let's try to put out this fire. I'm looking forward to the new EUP that's coming out. Um, I did try out the beta, I do have it, but I've been tending to use the regular Fucking version. Shit. But I am looking forward to the EUP beta. They're going to have some really cool uniforms. We'll be able to have some wild land firefighting uniforms, which will be much more realistic to what they'll be wearing compared to our regular turnout. Son of a bitch. All right, I think we may actually be able to put this out by ourselves. Damn. So we got the fire, looks like it's going to be knocked out. Just going to make sure there's no more spreading. Luckily it didn't get into these trees, that would have been a pain in the butt. Alright, let's get all this hose up and out of here. thing we are going to have to do is refill our tank because now we are, let's see how much water we have in here, not much at all. So we're going to make sure we refill just in case another call comes in. Alright, we are tonight back in service. Let's get back to the firehouse and get this thing filled up. Looks like we have another fire, guys. We didn't get dispatched to this one yet. How the heck are we gonna get to it, though? This one may be down on the beach. Oh my goodness, it's so much trap uh crap there I hate seeing people who live it. Alright now guys we did not uh fill up our tank. It would be cool if we could draft from the ocean here but that's not possible at the moment. So what we're gonna do let's start out another truck help us out here. I don't know how they're going to get the fire engine down here, but... Oh, here comes the engine. 
Alright, good, because we don't have no water. Alright, so while they're working on getting connected, I'm going to spray what I have there. Which is nothing, and we are out of order. Alright, so this is another cool new feature. So what they're going to do is drive up near us, uh, get out, and run a line to us. Don't mind my guy with his taser. He's just uh, protecting me from the wildfires. <laughs> just kidding. But, uh, yeah. Alright, we have been supplied with water. Jesus. Now we can put out the rest of this fire. Keep saying all right, and <laughs> the fire is not out. Fucking shit. Dissipating, fire appears to be out. Let's let the engine crew know that we are good. Maybe the engine, since they would be better equipped, they were able to draft from the ocean there. out of here. Is the engine okay? I hope they don't get stuck in the sand. Wait, are they still attached to me? They said they detached, but it looks like they may still be attached. So that's why this is still in beta, guys. So I've been playing this for a while, and this is the first time this ever happened, but like I said, this is beta, so bugs do appear here and there. Alright guys, we just got dispatched to a report of a fire in a gas station, we're going to respond to that. I'm going to take truck one, we're going to also bring engine one and battalion one as well. Chief doing? That's a tow truck, Chief. Oh my goodness! He <laughs> oh my god! He needs some help. Uh, we got smoke showing. Uh, 
I'm a little bit faster. I'm gonna try to get past the engine. Try to cut across the highway. Okay, it looks like they're gonna be going around the long way, so we're probably gonna get set up before they arrive on scene. Oh boy, this thing is up and flames, guys. Push on the inside and search for people. Alright, primary searches appear to be negative at this time. Doesn't look like anybody's in here. Let's continue to fight the fire. Now, I'm noticing my water isn't running out. Jesus. Guessing, um, I don't know why. <laughs> okay, I think we definitely shit. beat the engine in by a good mark. I wonder how far did they go down to try to turn around. Now another thing I could show you guys too, if I could get to the roof, I could show you guys how we could ventilate and then it would actually make the smoke disappear. So I'll show you guys how that works. Let's check for any more fire, all our thermals. Right, by the time the engine and the chief get here, we're going to have the whole fire knocked down. Oh, here they go. Alright, they're here. You guys are a little late. Chief is destroyed. Alright, let's get a ladder. And we're going to place this. So that we get up to the roof from here. the roof so we can pull out our halogen or actually like a pike here and if we do some ventilation you're gonna see the smoke kind of disappear a little bit there you go so that's another cool feature with the update now you only have to do it one time but we can role play doing it a little bit more make sure we get all of the smoke out of here like the fire is going to be under control. We're going to do our secondary searches just to make sure we didn't miss anybody. Uh, let's try to 
killed. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Alright, so we'll put that back in the truck. But, um, yeah, guys, that's going to do it for this episode. I really do hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, do me a favor. Make sure you guys go ahead and smash that like button. Leave some comments down below. Subscribe if you are new. Also, hit that notification bell so you can be notified whenever I post a new video. And if you guys would like to see me do some more uh, fire episodes with this pack, let me know in the comment section which other vehicles should I use next. Should I use the... Uh, technical rescue truck should I use the engine you want to do some cheap stuff let me know in the comment section down below um, also guys don't forget check out my merchandise um, actually new merchandise is going to be dropping December 4th guys that's the first Friday in December the new merch is dropping so if you guys want to get that make sure you put that on your calendar and look out for that also check out my website guys acepilot2k7.com on my website you guys can find a bunch of free mods uh, lists and tutorials so you guys can learn where to download mods from as well as how to install the mods completely for free I also have a way that you guys could become a supporter on my website that will give you access to my behind the scenes videos and on my behind the scenes videos I show you guys exactly how I do everything in my videos such as how I make the other fire trucks drive here by themselves or how they fly or follow me and all that type of stuff so if you want to see that definitely check it out I also have another section for supporters called first access and the first access section you're able to see videos that are exclusively only on my website so if you guys would like to see that definitely check it out again it is acepilot2k7.com but thank you guys so much for watching really do hope you guys enjoy and i will see you guys in the next one peace